is invading our home. They are brutal. Relentless. Unstoppable. We are 80 samurai against an army fighting to slow the invasion. Today, I die for my people. There must be thousands of them. We will face death and defend our home. Tradition. Courage. Honor. They are what make us. We are the warriors of Tsushima. We are samurai! Nobodachi. Oh! Go break their spirits. Hey! Outsiders, send your finest warrior to face me. Nada, Jinida. I am Haru Nobu Adachi, descendant of the legendary Yoshi Nobu Adachi. Lord Sakai, even if it cost us our lives. Men, we must hunt down the Mongol leader. Everyone, with me. No Mongol dog, cut them down. Good. 
left there is only one path for us find the mongol leader and end him here i'll fight beside you to the end i know Kotan, cousin of Kublai, grandson of Genghis. Brother, you are a warrior. I can see that. You trained your whole life for this, and you have won battles. The lesser men have called unwinnable, yes? But while you were sharpening your sword... ...do you know how I prepared for today? I learned. I know your language... ...your traditions... ...your beliefs... ...which villages to tame and... ...which to burn. So I'll ask you once again, Samurai. Do you surrender?
How did I get here? Someone worked hard to keep me alive. No weapons, just supplies. Need to keep moving. Mongols. Someone saved me. Hit me back here. Maybe they have my sword. Someone was sharpening their blade. A warrior. My armor. Broken. But better than nothing. my sword. Not here. You're all here. I'll take care of this. Please, hide. Oh, oh, don't hurt me! Shield of Lumini! Christ! You want your sword? Follow me. How long was I out? Long enough for the Mongols to conquer half the island. Save the others. Lord Shimura was with me on the battlefield. Did you go? Forget him. Yuna, wait. Lord Shimura is my uncle. You're Jin Sakai? The Jito's nephew? I have to know. Did he survive? I think so. The Mongols took him prisoner. Where did they take him? East, along the coast. Toward Castle Canada. They must be holding him inside, celebrating their victory. I could take them by surprise. You'll be killed. Or I'll rescue Lord Shimura. Then help him drive the Mongols into the sea. He can contact the Shogun. Call for reinforcements. I didn't nurse you back to health to watch you throw your life away. Why did you save me? I couldn't leave you to die. I need your help. Lord Shimura can help our whole island. And he's the only family I have left. Let's move. Help him. 
Riding across the island, taking slaves, killing the weak. No one's fighting back through here. We'll take the rooftops. Don't climb roofs, scavenge battlefields. You're a thief. When I need something, I take it. Like my katana? I traded it for food and medicine. You what? Don't worry. We'll find the buyer. Get your sword back. You've got a long ride ahead. Take whatever supplies you can carry. This is someone's house. And they're not coming back. Just up ahead. Toro! Shit. It must be here. Jin Sakai, nephew to the great Lord Shimura. And I am no coward! <laughs> Your enemy is no match for you. But you still lack control. I was practicing. With your father's weapon? The sword of Clan Sakai. Has saved lives and ended wars. Who did this to you? No one. I will teach you to defend yourself. I know how to fight. To master your blade, you must first control your emotions. I can do that, Uncle. Show me. Let's see what you've been practicing. Try to strike me. Yes, Uncle. Yeah. <laughs> I'm ready. Try to strike me. Well done. If you'd fought like that, your attacker would not have bruised you so easily. It wasn't a fair fight. Imagine he's returned to finish what he started. And he'll use every dirty trick he knows. How will you defend yourself? He's big. But I'm quicker. I'll stay out of his reach. Wait for him to get tired. Then drop him with one strike. Good. A samurai must always fight with patience and discipline. 
Even when his opponent resorts to trickery. I'll remember, Uncle. Now, break through my defenses. Show me Jin Sakai is a warrior of great courage. Break my block with a heavy attack, then strike quickly. A heavy attack will unbalance your foe. Follow with a quick strike. Enough! <laughs> I yield. You let me win. Not at all. If you held a real sword, I would be dead. Really? I would never lie to you, Jin. Now for a change, try to block my attacks. I will not go easy on you. A fine block. Good. Attack later. I'm sore. Can we take a break? We're not finished yet. Find your resolve and fight through the pain. Good. It's time you learn to parry. Wait for me to make the first move. Once I strike, block my attack. A fine parry. You must parry before I strike. Save your energy. Good form, Jin. You're improving. Need to catch your breath? <laughs> It'll take more than a child to knock the wind out of me. Now then, let's see you defend against a spear. Dodge my spear, then follow up with a counterattack. I am vulnerable after attacking. Excellent counter. Excellent dodge. Remember, dodge, then counterattack. You have a small opportunity to strike. Use it. You see, there is no weapon, no warrior you cannot overcome. Thank you for these lessons, Uncle. We are not finished yet. Jin Sakai, will you honor me with a sparring match? I wouldn't want to hurt you. If you're that confident, let's make this interesting. The first to land five strikes gets to choose dinner. I hope you like octopus. <laughs> Very good, Jin. <Jenna. laughs> Skill. Before we eat, I have one last question. For generations, our families have lived by a code. Tell me the virtues that guide us. Loyalty to our Lord, control over our emotions, and... You know this. Honor, to fight bravely and uphold the legacy of Clan Sakai. Those are your father's words. What does honor mean to you? I guess... ...protecting people. The ones who can't fight for themselves. You have a good heart. But first... ...we must show everyone that we serve our lord with courage. Integrity and self-control. You say that like it's easy. It's never easy, Jin. I struggle with it every day. But we must set an example for our people by remaining true to our code and to ourselves. That is the meaning of honor. Not her samurai. Your sword. Where can I find a horse? 
The stable's on far. This way. Islands crawling with them. Where are the stables? Behind that burning farmhouse. Follow me. We can get close, slit their throats, and kill them without a sound. Without honor. I will not break my code. Face me, invader! That's close. We can't save everyone. I'm done running, and I can finally help. Damn it! More guards. Don't let anyone escape. Thank you, my lord. They said all the samurai were dead. Do you have somewhere to hide? I heard Golden Temple might be safe. Go. Stay off the roads. And guard your son with your life. You risked your life for them. They couldn't defend themselves. And I... I can't let more of our people die. They're not the only ones who need you. My brother. The Mongols took him. That's why you saved me. Taka is my only family. And Lord Shimura is mine. Please. I just want my brother back. I'll help you find him after I save my uncle. I promise. I'm coming with you. Stables are just up ahead. Let's get to the horses. They're samurai horses. A few we didn't take into battle. Lucky for them. And us. Which horse do you want? Easy there. He suits you. And he needs a name. <laughs> Tuggy, born from the darkness. Holding your uncle inside. The walls are too high to climb. We could cause a distraction. Sneak in. No. We walk in the front gate. Kotun Khan set fire to our best swordsmen. Humiliated my uncle. Butchered the warriors of Tsushima. I'm going to repay his kindness. By repeating the same mistakes that got your friends killed. 
That's what the Mongols will think. But this time, I'll strike first. Wait here until I finish them. I've come for Lord Shimura. Whom he gets some <laughs> I'm surprised. What's all that noise? I'm not sure. The Mongols fired them off at the beach. All that noise. Not sure. Almost fired them off at the beach. Can't keep going. I have to fall back. Alone? Keep the path clear. When I find Lord Shimura, we'll need a quick escape. I'll get the horses ready. Do it. If I'm not back soon, ride for the forest.
Show me your skill. Sandra Deshte Samurai. Jin Sakai, nephew of Lord Shimura. I have come to avenge his honor. <laughs> Jin, your uncle has told me much about you, Jin Sakai. I will show him his nephew broken and humiliated, begging to join the Mongol Empire. <laughs> this is your time, Lord Sakai. Young master, it's time. I'm coming, Yuriko. The whole island has come to mourn your father. Can't you send them away? You must face them, Jin. You are now the master of Clan Sakai. Yes. You're not alone, Jin. Your father is the wind at your back. Your mother, the birds in the trees. And uncle? He will tell you. At your father's pyre. Thank you, Yuriko.
If you ever need guidance, Clan Adachi will help you. Your father protected the people above all else. A true samurai. Save him. I was a coward. King, you are a samurai. He died because of me. Your father fell in battle saving his only son. His reward is a warrior's death. Now you will carry on his legacy. Your father's spirit resides within his blade. He is always with you. How do I save? Jin, what happened? I found Lord Shimra. I could have saved him, but the Khan was there. I failed my uncle. At least you're in one piece. I swore to protect this island with my life. But now the Mongols have stolen our home, killed our samurai. You forgot what it's like to fight someone stronger than you. To feel weak. Sometimes when you're staring death in the face, you have to do whatever it takes to survive. The Khan. 
expects to fight a war against the Samurai. He will anticipate our every move. Unless we find new ways to surprise him. That's how we'll save Lord Shimura. And retake our home. We'll need some help. Riders. The Khan's attack dogs. There's too many of them. Hide in the grass. They must be searching for you. Bastards scared off the horses. They're samurai mounts, trained to return to their masters. Nice trick. The Mongols must be hunting you. We should split up. I'll draw their attention while you escape. I'm not leaving your side until we've saved my brother. First, I need to find more allies. Trained warriors. Like Sensei Ishikawa and Lady Masako Adachi. They can help. My brother can help too. Once we save him, you'll have the island's best blacksmith in your debt. He'll make whatever tool you need to save your uncle. Something to scale the castle walls? Do you dream it? Taka can make it. Where are they holding him? He was captured near Kechi. Ride there and ask around. I'll join you soon. Taka won't last long in the Mongol cage. You know, we will save your brother. And your uncle. Jin, you found me. You handle that well. I should have heard him coming. Let myself get distracted. These people saw Mongols marching prisoners upriver. They had a blacksmith with them. Your brother? Sounds like it. They were taking him to a camp near the Canada Inlet. I know the place.
Did you find any samurai to free your uncle? Not yet. But I'm still searching. I'm sure you'll find someone soon. Quickly, Taka. Taka can help you. After we save him. Hard to believe I might see him soon. He's lucky to have you. He might disagree. That's what siblings are for. What about you? Any brothers or sisters? Lord Shimura is my only family. What will you do when he's free? Take a breath. Because then I'll know there's hope for our island. You feel that strongly? I've watched him win victory against impossible odds. And after your brother is free, what then? Honestly, I haven't had time to think about it. You're riding well. How are your wounds? Mostly healed. Your bandages did the trick. You don't share much about how you feel, do you? I suppose you're right. My uncle taught me that a samurai masters his emotions. Like you master a horse. Or a blade. That's a hard way to live. It's not supposed to be easy. There's a spot up ahead that overlooks the river. Should give us a good view of the Mongol camp. There's the camp. Tough to get inside. The Mongols threw that place together in days. There has to be a way in. Let's look. <gasps> we need to reach Taka. ...without putting him in danger. We'll find a safe approach. You could scale the rocks on that side. If they're loose, they might give way. Alert the guards. The defenses in back are formidable. The front wall there is still under construction. There could be a way in. We can look for a gap in the front wall. Slip inside. And cut down the Mongols where they stand. If something goes wrong, they'll kill the prisoners. I've seen them do it. We have to go in quietly. Like thieves. What's wrong with that? Before the samurai, this island was ruled by criminals. We changed that by creating order and delivering justice in the open. We live by a code of honor. And sometimes we die by it. Warriors like my father, which just wanted to give us a safer home. I want the same thing, but we have to fight back. I promised my uncle I'd never break our code. Then bend it to save my family and what's left of yours. Let's get a closer look, see what we're up against. We should wait until it gets darker. Let's move. <laughs> Taka, he's been through a lot, even before the invasion. But you took care of him. Someone had to. He hated when I stole. But it was that or starve. He didn't have a choice. I didn't choose to be a samurai either. But going against my instincts. My code. It's better than getting wiped out by the Mongols. We have to fight back. Any way we can. Through here. If they see us, they'll kill the prisoners. We better stay quiet. And open their throats.
do you think, Jin? The bear's running with a limp. Your arrow wounded him. This is when a beast is most dangerous. Remain alert. Yes, uncle. Keep after him. I didn't think bears lived here. They don't. But the fighting in Yarikawa drove some this way. So it's the rebels' fault. We should feed them to this bear as punishment. We are not barbarians, Jin. bear stumbled here. Is it dying? No, but we're getting closer. Stay ready, Jin. Yes, uncle. If it's still alive, can I take the shot? Prove you can control your emotions. Then, perhaps. We got him. Careful. He could still be alive. This arrow should not have killed him. Look, uncle. There's a gash in his side. Not from an arrow. An assassin! From Yarikawa! Traitor! You would stab the chito in the back! Rosakai! Control yourself. We are not criminals like this man here. We are samurai. He tried to kill you. He must answer for this crime with his life. Then look him in the eye. And teach him that samurai never acts out of anger or fear. And take his life with honor. fight we face our enemy head on and when we take their life we look them in the eye with courage and respect this is what makes us samurai only cowards strike from the shadows Jin, what's wrong? Let's find your brother. We can't let them see us. Use all your senses. Think and move like a thief.
prisoner. Tucker? Let's find out. No, it's not Tucker. How'd you get in here? We need to go. We'll talk when it's safe. Come on. Let's get to the river. We'll be safe there. Are you with the Straw Hat Ronin? I was. I cut ties with them after they started running low on rations. Lord Shimmer has been captured, and I could use some extra swords to free him. Are you looking for work? No, but the other Straw Hats may be. Last I heard, they were hunting Mongols in Tsitsu Prefecture, by the coast near the Kishi grasslands. This way. We're looking for my brother, a blacksmith named Taka. Don't know him, but a lot of prisoners move through here. You said they were moving the slaves. Where? They mentioned Asimo Bay. And there was a blacksmith in the last group. Young man with a beard. From Yarikawa, maybe. You'd better be right. I hope you find your blacksmith. Taka's alive in Osmo Bay. The town is surrounded by walls. Rushing in without a plan will only put him in more danger. I have a friend who might be able to get us inside. Find him. The sooner we rescue Taka, the sooner we save my uncle. Jin. Taka will forge whatever tool you need as soon as he's free. But after that, we're leaving the island. You've seen what the Mongols are doing here. Lord Shimura can stop them. Stay. Help us fight for a home. Home is wherever Taka and I go. My friend lives in Asmo Prefecture. On the border with Tsutsu. I'll find you there. I know this wasn't easy. Going against your code. I did what I had to. Thank you. Lord Shimura. You deserve better than this. Convince your people to stop resisting, and you can walk free. Stop wasting my time. Kill me. Mm, you think you've lost everything. But your nephew is still alive. Jin. My men control the roads. They build war camps near your towns. They see everything. And they will find him. Lord Sakai will fight until his last breath. As will I. You love him. Just as you love your people. Your 
your father to them. Will you abandon your children? I won't make them your slaves. Good horse, Kage. Lord Sakai, I studied poetry with your uncle. The Mongols have taken Lord Shimura captive. Mm. He will endure. He is strong and resilient, skilled in the art of combat and poetry. Do you practice haiku, my lord? There is no time during war. War is the reason to make time. Haiku allows one to concentrate, eliminate chaos. To find peace. Precisely. My favorite place to ride lies atop the cliff. It is one of many such places. If you look, you will find inspiration all across Tsushima. I hope I can find quiet places like this one, untouched by war. Look for the birds. They will show you the way. Springs. Perhaps someone at the inn can direct me to Sensei Ishikawa. Forgive me, my lord, but you look fatigued. Have you endured much hardship? <laughs> you wouldn't believe it if I told you. But yes, I could use a rest. You should visit my sister in Hiyoshi Springs. I was sick, so she insisted I bathe in the waters. I could feel the life returning to my body. Sounds like just what I need.
My lord, would that be the blade of Clan Sakai? You know your swords. That is one worth knowing. I've heard tales of its sharp edge and beauty, but I never dreamed I'd see it in person. It has been some time since I trained on a bamboo stand. I would be honored to see your blade in action. The Sakai steel is a truly fine blade, wielded by an even finer swordsman. But training with bamboo will only make you stronger. I'll need strength for what lies ahead. There are bamboo stands throughout the island. They will help sharpen your skills on the journey. Farewell, my lord. Be weary from battle. Come, soak in the healing waters of these hot springs. Replenish your strength for the challenges to come. I must be at my best for all of them. Then follow me, my lord. Bathing in the hot springs restores your spirit and... If you make a habit of it, the waters will grant you a long and prosperous life. Enter here. The waters are warm and calm. Everything he's done for me, everything he taught me. I can't lose my uncle. I won't. I'm looking for Sensei Ishikawa. I thought he fell at Komoda. He didn't. Where is his dojo? To the forest. I can show you the way, my lord. Did the Sensei not fight at Komoda? No. He came to town for surprise the day before the invasion. Hardly spoke a word, but he's always been a private man. My lord, are the stories of Sensei Ishikawa true? What stories? They say he sank a pirate ship with a single arrow. <laughs> Not the ship, 
But he shot a pirate captain from the shore, routed the whole fleet. I'd hate to cross an archer like that. Do you deserve death? I hope not, my lord. Then you're safe from Ishikawa. The Sensei's dojo is up there on the cliff. Thank you. I'll take it from here. One more question, my lord. May I ask why the Sensei left his post as archery master to Clan Nagao? No one knows. Strange. Giving up service to a great lord for this. Sensei Ishikawa's dojo. There was a struggle here. Better look around. Someone was wounded. Remove the arrow. Dried blood. The fight wasn't recent. Don't move. Sensei Ishikawa. Lord Sakai's boy. <laughs> you survived Komoda. We could have used your bone. I was on my way when bandits attacked me. Are you expecting them to return? A samurai is never caught by surprise. I'm sorry about Lord Shimura. He was a good man. He's alive. Taken captive by the Mongols. Then there's hope. That's why I've come. Help me save him. I can't. My student is missing. A skilled archer. I will help you look. Then you can both help me free Lord Shimura. Try and keep up, Sakai. Who else made it out of Komuda? No one knows. Are there any others who can fight back? Besides us? I don't know yet. You'd better find out quickly. We can't free your uncle by ourselves. I can help track your student. I need no help tracking Tomoe. Tomoe? A woman? From what clan? No clan. A peasant. But she can outshoot any samurai I know. <laughs> Even you, Sakai. The last time I saw you was ten years ago. You came to study with me. 
You remember? I remember most of the students I reject. Instead, you took this Tomoe as your student. You showed promise. Tomoe is a prodigy. Mongols, take them. They fight like drunk Tanuki. They fought well enough at Komoda. Even Tanuki can catch a tiger when it's sleeping. The moist trail picks up here. Come! The Mongols took Fort Nakayama. That patrol likely came from there. That's close to the hot springs. The town will be the next to fall. Something happened here. An ambush. Look around. Blood. But not much. No one died. Rice and millet. Left uneaten. The attack was sudden. A Japanese quiver. A gift to my greatest student. I fear the worst. Tomoe would never leave the quiver behind. Unless she was pursued. Or captured. To what end? Interrogation. Torture. Worse. They may be doing the same to Lord Shimura. Fear is a weapon, Sakai. Do not let the Mongols use it against you. Your student. Where would they take her? Fort Nakayama. The fort is nearby. I should have fought the Komoda with you. Better you didn't. You lost enough there. Why did the samurai fail? The Mongols fought like animals. Wrong answer. I saw it with my own eyes. An archer's aim relies not on eyes, but on body, mind, and spirit. Stop here. We need to talk. What's wrong, Sensei? This bow was a gift to me from Lord Nagao many years ago. It's a beautiful weapon. Of course it is. And there's nothing more painful to me than a perfect bow ineptly used. Then it's a good thing you're giving it to me. <sighs> Who said anything about giving? Prove you can shoot straight. I'll let you borrow it. Try it out before we go into battle. Aim for that lamp closest to us. Now the one further down the road, on the left. <clears throat> Not bad. Let's see if you can hit the one furthest away. How does it feel? Like it was made for me. It wasn't. So take good care of it. Let's go. A bow like this would have helped at Komoda. It is a good bow, but victory is won by warriors, not weapons. You haven't seen the Mongols fire weapons. And they have not yet won. Fort Nakayama. I hope your student is inside. We'll get a better look at the defenses from up there. Mm, this spot is perfect. 
I'll find a way in. Open the gate. Then we hit them. Do you always charge into battle with your Hakama half tied? You have a better idea? Patience, Sakai. The Mongols will send men to find their missing patrol. When they open the gates, we strike. The longer we delay, the longer Tomoe remains in danger. She can take care of herself. Survey the battlefield. What can we use to our advantage? Hornet nests. One shot could stir them up. Mm, the Mongols will face the sting of insects and arrows. Those barrels could do some damage. We'll find out. An arrow in those hanging lights will kick up sparks. <laughs> and start fires. They have many archers. They're skilled, but we are better. When the gates open, distract the enemy and rain arrows on their heads. Then we storm the fort and free Tomoe. Good. Now we wait. They're opening the gates. Wait for my signal. to their ancestors. Wake up, Sakai! Not for long. Let's find Tomoe.
Slain prisoners. Tied up. Killed with arrows. Tomoe is in... Wait, this pendant belongs to her. Search the fort! Scroll. Archery terms with Mongolian translations. Your name is mentioned. She was teaching them my way of the bow. Someone's personal quarters. A woman's kimono. Tomoe's kimono. The Mongols freed her. Why? These arrows are Japanese. They're Tomoe's arrows. You are sure? I taught her to make the knock with deer horn. And that curve of the eagle feathers. So the Mongols took her weapons? The shots are tightly clustered. No Mongol shoots Japanese arrows with such skill. Huh. Then they allowed her to use a bow. Help me. Do you hear that? A survivor. We're looking for a woman, an archer. The Mongols caged her with us. But they set her free, gave her armor and a bow. She killed my wife and the others. The bodies we found. She proved her skill to the enemy, and they recruited her. Please. It... it hurts. Don't leave me. I've seen enough. Let's go. I should have killed her. Sensei? Tomoe won her freedom. And she joined the Mongols. Why would she do that? What happened? I pushed her too hard. Pushed her how? What are you hiding? Sensei! I demand an answer. She attacked me. Not bandits. Tomoe. Why? She has no idea what it means to be samurai. You drove her to the Mongols. 
Do not judge me. Do not lie to me. I can't let Tomoe teach my way of the bow to the enemy. And we will stop her. This is my fight. I don't need your weapon. No, you need me. Victory is won by warriors, not weapons. Hmm. Lord Shimura raised you well. We'll hunt them away together, but we do it my way. And when the time comes, you will help rescue my uncle. You have my word, Sakai. I will prepare to hunt Tomoe. When you are ready, meet me at my dojo. We can't rescue my uncle alone. I need more people to join our fight. Fine lady Masako Adachi. If she's still alive, she's one of the finest warriors on the island. are everywhere. In a fight, they will surround me like wolves. I need to find new methods to keep them at bay. A well-balanced blade I can throw to catch a foe by surprise and finish them off. Sakai! Sensei, any word on Tomoe? Yes, but I'm not sure you are ready for her. You make her sound like a demon. That's not far off the mark. Tomoe is fearless. She is not samurai, but she is a born killer. I know the type. No, you do not. Come. Where are we headed? An archery range. The locals saw Mongols training there. I suspect Tomoe was with them. If Tomoe is truly fearless, she'd make a useful ally. A starving leopard is fearless too. Leopards can't master your way of the bow. Let it go, Sakai. She will never join us. Why does she turn against you? I took a risk sharing all I knew with her. When she betrayed my trust, I punished her. It must have been harsh. You saw what she did to the prisoners at Fort Nakayama. That was no mistake. That was a choice. And not the first time she's made it. We don't know it was her fault. You don't. I do. You have to climb to get there. Sure you can make it, Sensei? What are you waiting for, Sakai? You need a hand, Sensei?
Not bad, Sakai. You said the only way up was to climb. No. I said you had to climb. It's good exercise. Arrows, Mongo and Japanese. If they were here, they're long gone. We might pick up their trail by the practice target. There is no target. Near that watchtower. Not bad, Sensei. Find out where they went. Move it, Sakai. How many Mongols is Tomoe training? A severed head. Used for target practice. Sensei, Mongols here. <laughs> Sensei, I could use your help. Sensei, I could use your help. Good work, Sakai. Resting your bow arm, Sensei? Observing your response to an ambush. You knew those Mongols were still here? Yes. You didn't think to mention it? If you can't handle a few Mongols, what good will you be against Tomoe? This is war, not a test. And how many wars have you fought? I'll test you as I see fit. I can see why Tomoe attacked you. <laughs> now, where did she go, Sakai? I'll look around. A lot of tracks. A dozen men. Maybe more. Follow the trail. If we catch her, do not wait for me. Attack and keep moving, or you'll die. Do you plan to use your bow this time? If we find her. 
And if not... Can you take a dozen enemy soldiers without me? If I must. Good answer. Practicing what Tomoe taught them. Murdering the innocent. You see a Japanese woman with these Mongols. I couldn't believe it. She was giving them orders. What did she say? Something about the sensei and the hot springs. That's all I heard, my lord. Forgive me. monster out of hunt. They heard Tomoe giving orders to the Mongols. She mentioned Hiyoshi Springs. She's just getting started. Sakai, the way you fight, it's not your uncle's way, and it's not mine. We've never faced an enemy like this. I do what I must to defeat them. A samurai is a guardian. Not a killer who darts around like a thief. You didn't see Komodo. I've seen enough. 
I know it was brutal, but I won't train another monster. I know. I won't let that happen. If Tomoe is going after Yoshi Springs, I need to prepare. So do you. I'll see you at my dojo, Sakai. Sakai. Any news of Tomoe? Travelers have been shot dead on the roads in and out of Hiyoshi Springs. People are afraid to leave or deliver supplies. You think that's our doing? Hmm. A few archers at strategic points can isolate a whole town. A tactic of yours when you were Clan Nagao's archery master. Tomoe was a good student. Too good. We're fighting your own reflection. We will turn that to our advantage. Come. How do you propose we find these archers? We think like Tomoe. We want to control movement in and out of Hiyoshi Springs. Where do we put archers? It would be smart to control the main entrance into town. Mm, people already avoid the main road. Archers there would be wasted. That path behind the inn? No. Poor cover, no clear lines of sight. You want to cover the largest territory with the fewest archers. A handful of men could shut down the road to the coast. Yes. I would want someone looking over the bridge into town. So would I. The road south runs along a high ridge. Perfect place to rain down arrows. Tomoe would agree. There's hope for you. Let's go hunting. What else did you teach Tomoe? I held back nothing. Including why you left Clan Nagao? That's no secret. It was time to retire, and the hot spring suited me. <laughs> you would never willingly retire. What's your definition? My uncle said you became close to a commoner, and Lord Nagao was forced to cover it up. <laughs> your uncle has an interesting sense of humor. You weren't forced out? A samurai always has a choice. But do you regret giving up a warrior's life? Mastery of the bow is mastery of oneself. That is the only victory worthy of a samurai. The rest is noise. We're getting close. Eyes open. Thank <laughs> you. 
Those innocent, dead. Tomoe has thrown everything away. Betrayed her people. She is a traitor because the Mongols offer power, wealth, status. It was denied her by birth. Tomoe knew she was born to a lower station than she deserved. Now you're being too kind. Kindness can be useful, even to a warrior. Let's go. My uncle. And he didn't tell me. He showed me. Mercy creates a debt. Your uncle showed mercy.
You know the name Ishikawa? I do. I have message. Speak. Sensei, all of Hiyoshi Springs will beg for mercy, like the victims of Hironori Naga. Silence! Hironori Nagao. Didn't he die fighting bandits? It was decades ago. He was reputed to be a great archer. Did he study with you? No. Tomoe is spreading lies. But there's a seed of truth. She wants us to doubt each other. We are all that stands between Hiyoshi Springs and a bloodbath. Then we stand together. Hmm. We'll plan the town's defense at my dojo. Meet me there, and be ready to fight! Can't give up yet, boy. <laughs> 